just made it a trend But every queen's greedy reign must come to an end Don't act like you're perfect, you've made a million mistakes Trying to count all of your failures would give me a headache You caught your man, drugged him, and tied him down in some place But he managed to escape and even slapped you in the face What kind of a yandere would let her man go free? And do I even need to mention the thing with Tsubaki? At least I got to go on a date with him, unlike you You get so nervous around Taro, you don't even know what to do Except squirm around as if your IQ dropped a five a difference if you're fine around Yuki. I'm still more stable than you. And my parents still love me. Or do I have to throw you back in that little cage you hate? I'll lock the door, melt the key, and let the rats seal your face. I got Yuki in the end and became a god, remember? A yandere never stops, gives up, or surrenders. But when your senpai sees you slice a girl's throat open, you fall to your knees and end up heartbroken. When the screen fades to black, that doesn't mean that's a wrap because you seem to have forgotten that I have the choice to say you may have grown to be a yandere, but I was born broke. Now let's see whose name you scream when I rip your chest open. Epic rap battles of Academy. Yandere Chan versus Yandere Kun. Begin. Trying to steal my senpai? Who do you think you're dealing with? If you try and take him, just know I have a knife at home with your name on it. I'm the hero of this story. You're the fanboy wannabe. But if you really want to fight, <laughs> then please try and beat me. There are many things that I could do that you would never dare. I doubt you'd have the courage to take and claim senpai's underwear. Or tie a rival to a chair and make her wish she was never born. So drop the act and leave. I'm sure you're missing some freaky cable porn. It's funny how the world is so enamored with your position That only a girl can fill your part for a story's true fruition But you see, let me tell you about Rule 63 All characters have an opposite sex counterpart Like me, I'm the guy you don't wanna mess with So you better run and hide I'll laugh my ass off as I slit your throat open and watch you die It's not like Senpai will miss you since he'll just end up loving me So I'll give you one verse to back away and beg me for mercy You think that you're scary? Let me show you something frightening You can't exist in a world filled with social justice lightning. A man can't be a yandere, he's a stalker, take him out! My sex gives me a pass, you're what they cry wolf about. <laughs> you think politics will stop me? Just take a look around. People crave my existence, that is being wrong sound. It doesn't matter what we are, so your little verse just went to waste. So leave senpai to me, you sad pathetic waste of space. <laughs> you're funny for a dead man. And now you're wasting my time, I have to go make sure senpai's safe. I told you asshole, he's mine, you won't take him from me. I'll kill you before you even get the chance. You really think so? I know so. Alright, let's dance. Hey Yamada, I have to ask you something. Huh? Um, sure. What is it? Do you do anything other than sit there and read? Well, I... Look, I won't dance around the issue, so I'll get to the point. Why don't you join the martial arts club? What? Why? Because it's beneficial! You'll learn self-defense, work out, and- Sorry, Matsuda, but I have to say no. Why? What is it with you and turning down every club that approaches you? Well, I- You know what? I have a better idea. How about I show you, and the entire school, why you should stop loitering around and join a club? What? So let me get this straight. You just sit there and read without a care in the world or a want or a need. Would you call that living? I call that being a bum. You'll be begging to join my club when this rap battle's done. Tara, you blend into the crowd with some friends here or there. But what you really need is a purpose, not just sweet fresh air. How about I show you how to defend yourself so you can survive? After that, you'll finally know the meaning of being alive! You got nothing to say? Come on, show me what you can do! I know a million ways to fight you and a hundred ways to block you. Taro, say something! You really have nothing to say? If you don't, then why the heck won't you see things my way? Look, Matsuda, I'm just not interested, alright? Why would I join a club like yours unless I'm looking for a fight? I just want to read in peace, but you just had to open your mouth, so let me shut you up and tell you what this Yamada is all about. I'm an average teenage guy trying to get by in school without anyone's approval and not looking like a fool. Unlike you, I mean, come on, you walk around like Bruce Lee telling people, hey, join my club, we do karate. 
But let's face it, why learn about fighting unless you plan to use it anytime you want? What's your thoughts on that then? If you can't defend that, then you've already lost. Now, pardon my English, but can you kindly fuck off? There's no need to get hostile, buddy. I just wanted to convince you that there's more to life than reading what fictional characters will do. You can laugh all you want, but you might not great rejoining me. If someone goes berserk and starts a random killing spree. Now see, that logic just doesn't make sense. If no one hears a psycho, then why should I learn defense? Unless you're planning something Buddha. Wanna spill what that's about? Why learn defense unless you plan to knock someone out? You're putting words in my mouth! Then stop trying to judge me, okay? I like reading! Get over it! But how is that okay? Like, all you do is read! What kind of girl finds that attractive? What? Is that what this is about? What about being active? You dense motherfucker! Would you look up for once? There's a bunch of girls that think you're the cutest of the bunch! How can you be so blind despite the reading you keep doing? Gah! What am I saying? Heck, who am I fooling? Now see, unlike you, I don't care about someone's looks. I just want them to be kind and maybe like some of my books. If you want a girl that badly read and see how far that goes, you've made an ass of yourself and now everybody knows.